Hello guys, welcome back to Abstronic Circuit Tutorial and let me explain how the street light working as you can see the main component of the circuit MOC 3062 with two component from the internal circuit LED which is connected from pin 1 and pin 2 and from the other side is triac which is connected to pin 4 and pin 6 so when the voltage applied from pin 1 and pin 2 then the internal LED will be glowing and shedding the light to the triac then the internal triac receiving the rays of light from the LED then it will be activated in the left side circuit is DC low voltage on the other side it is AC high voltage the transistor 2 and 3904 acting like an open and closed switch to turn on and off the internal LED which is connected from pin 1 and pin 2 the variable resistor is to adjust the flow of the current through the LDR in order to control the LDR timing based on the darkness and the daylight. One kilo ohms resistor is used to control the flow of the current through the transistor during the transistor activated. 100 ohms resistor is used to control the flow of the current and to protect the external LED and the internal LED which is connected from pin 1 and pin 2. BT136 is a triac to drive the external load and to avoid the internal triac overloading from the external load. 10 kilo ohms resistor is used to control the flow of the current flowing through the triac. And the light bulb will be the external load. Now, let me explain how the entire circuit working. So let's get started. When the sun rising in the morning, the LDR sensing the sunlight rays, the LDR sensor decreasing the resistance, then the current easily flowing from the battery through the base of the transistor and this current passing through the variable resistor and LDR. Then the collector emitter acting like a closed switch 
to allow the current flowing through 1 kilo ohms resistor entering to the collector and goes out from the emitter then back to the ground so no current flowing through 1 red ohms resistor and through the lead then the optocoupler deactivated but when the evening come the LDR sensor increasing the resistance so let's go back to the circuit diagram and let assume it is during the night time since the resistance of the LDR increasing during the night time then the current from the battery will be resisting by the LDR resistance so the transistor will be deactivated now the current just flowing through 1 kilo ohms resistor and through 100 ohms resistor entering to the lead then entering to pin 1 and goes out from pin 2 then back to the ground so the internal lead which is connected from pin 1 and pin 2 will be activated as you can see the internal lead glowing and shed the light through the triac then the triac will be activated so the AC current flowing through the lamp and 10 kilo ohms resistor entering to pin 6 then goes out from pin 4 and flowing through the gate of the triac then BT136 will be activated and allow the AC current flowing from terminal 1 to terminal 2 then back to the AC source now you can see the light bulb is lighting then when the night falling into the daylight the LDR sensing the daylight causing the resistance decreasing to allow the current from the battery flowing through the LDR and feeding to the base of the transistor then the current flowing through 1 kilo ohms resistor entering through the collector and goes out from the emitter then back to the negative side of the battery since the transistor activated and allow the current flowing through it then there's no current flowing through 100 ohms resistor through the lead and no current flowing through pin 1 then the internal lead will be deactivated so the internal triac not receiving any lead light therefore it will be deactivated so the AC current will be cut off then the circuit 
will be reactivated. So no current flowing through the circuit. Therefore, all the light will be off. Then the process just keep repeating again. So that is how the street light circuit working during the day and night. Now let's see the actual circuit.